Uh, I'm not so sure that there is any organization like uh, like PEP with the breadth that it has. I mean, so many different, uh, the online school, the vocational training and educational programs, the, dis the program for the uh, disability, the Dolores Huerta uh, child care, and you know, uh, the youth programs, building the homes. I don't think there's any other program in the country that has that breadth of activity. And that's, I think, uh, I think that's very unique. And I can honestly say, now that I've gone back and, and reflected that Dr. Arnold's direct involvement with UFW and my dad really served to develop some of the programs that the UFW developed over the last 20 years. I think it's fair to say that my dad learned from the best. And as I go around the country, uh, believe me, I'm, I'm going to tout what you've done here because I think it's uh, something to be uh, very, very proud of. You know, I understand that you're making an effort to rename uh, South 6th Avenue Avenida yeah. Cesar Chavez. Uh, I think that's important uh, for a couple of reasons. One is that it continues the legacy of my father and what he did. I think, I think that's important. But I don't think that should be the most important reason. I think the most important reason is that uh, Latinos need, need heroes. Uh, and, you know, we have athletes and we have entertainers, uh, but we need heroes. We need he heroes to make a difference in terms of humanity. We change the lives of people like Cesar Chavez and John Arnold have done.